Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and No Place Like Home, which you've probably seen before on the channel, is finally leaving early access. Full release? Yes, indeed. Survive a toxic wasteland and reclaim the world and build your own farm in this wonderful little base building crafting farming game which so much more to do. You guys can get this game with the link down below in the description today. And thanks to the developers, the makers of No Place Like Home for sponsoring today's episode. Well, good to see you all here. Let's jump in and check out what's new for full release. Okay, so here we are. We got our nice little, uh, well, we got a little tree farmhouse here. And of course, as you'd imagine, Earth is absolutely trashed with toxic waste. Hello, chicken, how are you? Greetings, m'lady. Uh, you're a talking chicken. Ah, human speech isn't the hardest thing a chicken can learn. Uh, what's your name? I'm Cornelius the Brave, hero of the lands and protector of the innocent. But you're a chicken. Ah, your observational skills serve you well. Uh, give me a quest, please. All right, then. I, get, I guess you haven't read the chapter from Farming for Dummies? The what now? Well, I'd love to equip you with a copy, but it must be somewhere around here. <laughs> okay. Collect the Farming for Dummies and bring it to Cornelius. All right. So we got to clean things up. Now, the cool thing about this game is that we've got, like, basically a vacuum. And we can clean all this up as well as the area around town. It's not just this little area. But we've got a massive amount of area to clean up of toxic waste and garbage. And we can take seeds and other things that we find from here in order to uh, basically farm more and farm better. There are enemies and other things to watch out for, so we can even water our plants with a right click and whatnot, so let's go ahead and get to it. It's going to take a while. Some things can't be uh, sucked up right away, so let's keep drilling. Oh, there we go. Lots of potatoes. Ah, and a field here for us to clean up. Nice. I guess Cornelius is the chicken with the hat. Wow, look at all the garbage over there. Uh-oh, robots. Hello. Combat, wow. Nice, got him. All right, let's get rid of these junk piles. The more we take down, the better, because of course, we'll be able to uh, add more crops to our farm and possibly find more materials to build and do stuff with. Good, all right, let's get it all cleaned up. All right, the other thing we could do, along with drilling, is now vacuuming, so... Let's get it all cleaned up. Oh yeah, that's satisfying. Oh, we're picking up so many seeds and things. Ah, oh, perfect. Oop, sorry, farm field. All right, let's get all these plants watered a little bit. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice, they're already growing, perfect. All right, a little bit more trash to clean up. Hey, that's new. What's in there? Is that the book? No, some building materials, okay. All right, let's keep on cleaning. It is really satisfying to pick up all this stuff, I will say. Yeah. Oh, there it is. That's gotta be the book. All right, let's get back to Cornelius, but first, let's clean out our working area a little bit. We still got a lot more work to do, but looking good. I do like our house, by the way. Very nice to clean this area up. Oh, another uh, piece of luggage with more materials inside. They look like honey. Oh, it's a prepared meal. All right, a few more things to clean up here for the initial start area. Good, good. Oh, another piece of luggage. And more materials, awesome. Now, one thing I've seen in this game too is that I, I believe you can actually get um, like different areas to store your stuff in. So, you know, of course you have like your inventory with all sorts of different things you can put in it. But of course, and our hot bar at the bottom, uh, but I think we can also customize inside of our home too. So let's take a quick peek inside. And, uh, oh, hi, Mark. Oh God, found it out in the old tree house. My grandpa told me I should look for his old friend, Mark. Find a way to the shopkeeper on the way to the village. Yeah, we gotta leave town, but we can customize the inside of the house and that's nice. And this is absolutely filthy. How did this happen inside? Who threw all this trash inside the, uh, oh, a secret room? I like secrets. Okay, get the rest of this stuff out of the way. Uh, what is the book? Dear Ellen, I don't know if you decided to accept my invitation, but if you did, if you're reading this, I'm so glad you made it safely. I'm really sorry I'm not here to greet you myself. I must still be on my mission. Oh, is that from you, Grandpa? All right, he wants us to find the uh, friend down at the, uh, down at the old shop. Cool. So we can sleep here and then customize stuff inside and there's a secret 
hope that's just like a fake door. All right, let's go chat with Cornelius the chicken. There he is. I imagine that's him on the left, although Cornelius is wearing a hat. Hey, fast travel point unlocked to Grandpa's old farm. Cool. You don't have to walk everywhere. All right, Cornelius, I found the book. There you go. Congratulations. The This is the book. At least part of that was important. Now, I'm happy to say you're ready for your quest. My quest? I have a lot of things to attend to, being a hero of these lands and a protector of the innocent, you see. All right. Well, we're trying to find our grandfather, Mr. Chicken. Well, can't tell you where he is, not until I put aside my worry that brothers and sisters are properly cared for when I'm gone on the journey. Oh, you want me to take care of the chickens? Build a chicken coop and befriend a couple of my mates by handling, handing them delicious potatoes. Build a chicken coop and befriend five chickens. Cool. All right. So now we can start making a chicken coop. That's cool. All right. Oh, boy. No, no, no. Good. Got him. What oh, did you drop? A battery? There we go. All right, chickens. I'm going to make a little coop for you probably over here. Be a good spot. On this uh, side of the fence. So, let's see here. Quests map oh now we see a map okay so there's like a railroad to the right we're here in the lower right corner so the shop could be over to the left and some other areas to farm and somebody with a gadget up at the top oh a bunch of collectibles oh look at how good those mashed potatoes look right there that is an incredible looking bowl of mashed potatoes that is awesome of course the thing of tomato soup and pet food too so we'll probably need that for the chickens maybe okay anyway it looks like there's um maybe grains Stamps, f vegetables, and feathers or something we can collect? Okay. Cool. Lots of cool collectibles, that's for sure. All right, let's check out uh, how we build a chicken coop here. Oh, it looks like we can also build farm plots pretty easily. We can put those around, no problem. All right. Very nice. Oh, what's all this stuff then? Oh, Mark the shopkeeper's right here. Wait. Mark, are you... I, I don't even see Mark. Well, anyway, what do we got here? The Recycler. This can take things and turn them into something else. Crafting cost is 12. It transforms trash into recycled material. That's good. Uh, we've got a crafting station here. So this makes us all sorts of furniture for the house, which is really nice. And there's different styles, too. Japanese, garden, kitchen, and cute. Cool. Not bad. Ah, and here we go. We have the ability to recycle all of our stuff if we want to. So we can make more of those recyclers and eventually get building materials out of those. And it looks like we get potatoes. Ah, yes, I think birds deliver us different seeds and stuff per day for our farm. If we happen to run out, that's cool. All right, nice. Let's get on to building a chicken coop then, and we'll see how that goes. Oh, and also a chest to store items, which is helpful too. Okay, let's build that chicken coop. All right, so it looks like under the workshop, we've got all sorts of different options. There's the chicken coop, but we also have a pigsty, a cow shed, and a basic bird feeder, and then upgraded versions of those. Building styles look really nice. I do, I do like this art style for all the custom buildings, from the small to the large. That's a big old cow shed. That almost looks like a house. All right, let's start with the uh, chicken coop. Then we can craft for 15. There we go. Now we got that in our inventory. We can place that down, and it's got a little area around it too, so I wanted to put it over on this side. So let's put it over here. Uh, let's see if we can try to avoid bumping into that other chicken. Sir, could you move? It's the perfect spot for my chicken coop. Oh, he's in the way. All right, I'll just put it right here. That's okay. Oh, sir. Well, there we go. Perfect. Oh, that's a small little area to sneak by, but that'll do. I'm sure we can move it and upgrade it and stuff later. All right, let's befriend some chickens. You want some potatoes, right? Okay. So, let's go ahead and harvest some potatoes, and grow some potatoes. There we go. Oh, looks like another one's ready for harvest. All right, we need five potatoes to make five chicken friends. Cool. And chickens will eventually equal chicken nuggies, so that's good. Animal befriended. Good. All right, so we just basically need to feed them, and they'll be our friend. They'll trust us, and then we can put them in the coop. 
All right, R to open animal inventory. We gotta find some more. They're out here somewhere. A lot to do in just this small area. Outside of this area is more toxic ruins with, uh, like, guns that'll shoot at you and more robots and things like that. Little turrets and things that are constantly on defense. Hardcore game of Wally is what that is. Another, uh, luggage? Box of something. Oh, what was that? Oh! What is that? That's what's making the noise. Oh! What is that? It's gonna build something? It looks like it requires a building. It might work for us if we build, like, a charging station for it or something. It doesn't seem to be hostile, but he's covered in trash. Or he was. All right, wow, we've almost got all of our property cleaned up. There's another uh, piece of luggage. And some more prepared meals, which always looks like honey. Okay, we're going to need to make a well soon, too, to get more water. Hey, another book. Oh, a garden fan. Ah, that unlocks decorations for us. Cool. All right, let's keep drilling. We can also smack the piles if we want to, but the drill is just the easiest way to walk forward. Ah, if we need more water, we could probably get it here. Oh, hello. Sir, you don't want to go in the water. You're a robot. Uh, can't pick up the battery. But we can suck it up with the vacuum. Alright, let's keep drilling. Ah, uh, nice area over here to build stuff. So definitely a good idea to clean out the whole farm and build a chicken coop. Once everything's co uh, completely cleaned out, that'll be just fine. I love this. Alright, we're almost done cleaning up the farm. A little bit to go. Oh, I see apples. Oh no, those are... Uh, Tomatoes. Maybe we got some other seeds other than tomato and potato. Potato, potato, maybe. Ah, there we go. Look at that cleanup, baby. Another piece of luggage with another type of seed in it. And that should do it for all the piles, I think. Oh, except for that corner. All right, a little bit more to go. Wow, this thing really sucks, doesn't it? In a good way. Okay, was well, there a rock over there that we can maybe break? Well, maybe eventually we can break through that stuff. Okay, let's grab the rest of the uh, trash. The loose garbage. Oh, there's a little bit more in the corner. Oh, nice, we can like Double team it like that. We can do two piles at once. Oh, there's more on the other side. Much more on that side, yeah. I can see a pipe and stuff over there, too. And a little shop. A little building there. What is this? A robotic llama? What is this? Hello? Oh, it needs a... Um parking area. So we have a mount. We have a vehicle that we can drive. Cool. Or something. At least it looks like it. Alright. I think we're pretty clean now. I'm sure we missed something. There we go. Much more to clean over here. And that might be what that llama needs in order to operate. Cool. Alright. Any of the potatoes ready? Nope. Let's go find some more chickens. We got two of them to come into the coop. We gotta find t uh, three more chickens. They could be anywhere. Well, let's find the rest of these guys. Whoa, okay. That one shoots acid. Okay, I hope there's no chickens over here. Gotta help that robot out. Alright, we'll finish off the last of these guys. Cool. 
All right, now we just got to deal with the ones that shoot acid, but uh, I guess we can go in here later. I need to find more chickens, though. Oh, there's something up there. Actually, now I'm a little bit more curious to go up the ladder. Maybe, maybe these other chickens are hidden somewhere else. All right, let's go up the ladder. Who could be up here? Oh, there's a box. Oh, a sunny side up. Got an egg. And what is that? A feather. All right, nice. So it just leads back down. Okay, so we got a new ingredient, eggs, which we'll get regardless from the chickens. What's in here? Oh, it looks like it needs a button or something to open. Yep, there's the button. Ooh, those guys are shooting at me. There's another llama over there. I don't even hear any more chickens. Maybe we can buy some. Oh, a new blueprint. Oh man, what did we unlock? Clean gr Oh, it's a, a scrap item. Oh, it's a quest item? Yeah, it is. Used to create a disco ball for chickens. Okay. So by clearing all the whole area, we're getting some of the quest items early. So when we're tasked with keeping the chickens happy, I'm sure that'll be the next thing. We're already way ahead of the game. Oh, you can drill the robots, but it takes a lot longer to do. Ah, that's why I didn't hear the chickens. One of them's in a cage. There you go, sir. And we need to get you a potato. I'm sure the other ones are almost done growing. We might need to wait another day. All right, more tomatoes. Ah, oh, we can get water this way by vacuuming it up. Cool. Secret waterfall? Yeah. Always the secret behind the waterfall in these games. All right, we got a lot of building material now. Now, the last chickens must be in these piles, then. There must be another one in what looks to be a little junkyard area. Well, I guess this whole place is one giant junkyard now. Another box. More prep meals. Oh, a plant field. Oh, that's a crafting item. Oh, and what is that? A bowler hat. Cool, we can customize our appearance. Nice. That's cool. Now, I'm assuming these little robots might be helpers for the future, so they'll water plants for us or take care of animals. Maybe. That'll be good. Okay. More chickens to find in here. Nasty robots. Alright, let's clean up the rest of this area. I must say the drill is quite satisfying. There we go. Cool. Oh. Wait, what is that over there? I see something on the corner. Oh, it's a chicken. And there's a guy there, too. Who's that guy? Hello, sir. Okay, chicken number two released from the cages. That gives us four. Hello, who are you? Helen, is that you? We haven't seen each other in ages. It's Rudy. Oh, hi, Rudy. You've grown so much. Well, thank you. Mostly thanks to your grandpa. He helped me big time. Is there anything I can help you with to return the favor? Oh, do you have anything for sale? Oh, he's got uh, drill upgrades. But it costs us one egg. Ah, cool. Oh, plus one egg. So we need 50 prepared meals and an egg, and we can get drill upgrades. Awesome. And then there's upgrades for 
picking berries faster, too. Okay. Nice. So, everybody does offer us some pretty helpful upgrades. Alright, well, let's keep drilling. So once the chicken coop is operational and once we're making a bunch of food, then we can start making prepared meals. We're doing meal prep. That's cool. Man, look at all the garbage peels. Or I mean banana peels in the garbage. Stereotypical stuff in the garbage. Banana peels. Maybe an old sneaker. Like a little uh, fish skeleton. Oh boy. Hey, there's that building we were trying to unlock. I think that's it. Looks like a... It looks like it's for llamas, but it looks like a real-life llama. Does that look like a llama or a sheep? It could be a sheep, but I don't I don't think sheeps have those big, uh, big ears. Those big ears are not for sheep, I think. All right, one more thing to break down. One more tower, anyway. Oh, and... Oh, there's plenty more of these things to find around. The cool thing is, is those will never go away, so if we miss them, we'll be good. And then just three here. Any secrets? Oh, there's much more than I thought. That's satisfying, though. All right, just like mowing the lawn, we'll go around the outside. a few near the water, but we'll get the fenced-in area first. What is this? Scraps of fabric. Awesome. Ooh, wait a minute. I see another suitcase in there. Hold on. I need to know what's in there. Oh, we need a box to go over there. Okay. Need to build a box or something there. Nice. Oh, and more crates. Cool, more luggage, good. Very nice. Wow, lots more luggage. Another chicken. Alright, well, that's all of our feathered friends. Now we just need the taters to make them happy. And that's most of this area cleaned up. Oh, well, there's many more of these boxes around. Look at that. Alright, a little bit more trash, a few more things around, but let's go see if we can work on our garden a little bit for these chickens. We'll come back for anything we missed. Okay, we've got three more potatoes ready to go. So that should be everything the chickens need. So all the rest of them were in cages. Hopefully they don't wander around too far. Oh, they're exactly where we left them. One for you. Chicken number three. Chicken number four. And do we get to chicken number five? Can we cross water? No. Oh, waterfalls are so pretty. Oh, look, they're just marching right into the chicken coop. <laughs> oh, this area we got to clean up too? There you are. Perfect! Five out of five, and we built a chicken coop. Now we gotta go back to Cornelius. All right, we'll clean up this area too. It's all one giant cleanup job with farming and so much more. All right, all the chickens are on the way. Now I certainly wanna move this thing. I think I should move it like over here, but we can do that later. Or build an upgraded one and scrap this one later maybe. That'd be cool. Hi Cornelius, 
Job's done. Ah, magnificent. Have you found the perfect outfit for your favorite chicken yet? Uh, what now? Uh, they're fond of costume as much as humans are. What, like your hat? All right, tell me more. We're having a party. Oh, that's why we need the disco ball, of course. Necessary parts are under trash piles. Uh, give all parts to Cornelius. Find five scraps of fabric. Okay, so we need one more fabric. Cool. Very nice. A little bit more junk here and there. Obviously, the fabric will be in here, then. Because this is our last area to clean up. Perfect. Ah, that's our fabric right there. All right, we got everything we need. Let's just take care of the rest of the piles. Cool. Now, the good thing about all this trash is we can put it in the recycler, so for the time being, we've got a lot of material we can find from this. So if we make a few recyclers, it'll process it faster. And then, of course, we can build more things like plant fields and chicken coops and get other raw materials to upgrade and repair buildings, such as that little shed over there. All right, Cornelius, I think we got everything. All done. Amazing! Let it be known that Sir Cornelius is as skilled with a needle as with a sword. Here, you have a... What? You want me to try it on? Return to me once you've placed a hat on your head of your favorite chicken. Oh. All oh, right, do it with the R key. Give a hat to a chicken. How about you? Let's give you the banana hat. Good. Oh, we can give them to the chickens. That's cool. Hey, and we can take eggs now. So we go back to our friend. I guess we don't have to feed them. Is it automatic? Okay. All done, Sir Cornelius. All right, let's proceed to the last piece of the puzzle. Clean three glass scraps and give them to Cornelius. Oh, we got to find three of those for the disco ball, I'm assuming. Of course. Come on, let's make sure these are still grown. We'll have to plant the farm. So I guess what we could do here is we could make a farm field for each specific crop. For example, this could all be potatoes, and uh, another one could be all uh, maybe tomatoes, that type of thing. Also, planting is easy. You just click on your hotbar, what you want, and then you just click where it goes. So that's pretty easy. Plant the whole field, I guess, and then water it. And then we can also do tomatoes in another field, because we got a few farm plots, too, but I guess for the first round, we'll just do potatoes. Um, that's weird. Okay, we'll have to come back for a little bit more water. Alright, now, we also need to find some glass scraps. We must have to go somewhere else. Let's see. What is this? A little door? That looks like it's for an elf. Oh boy. An elf. Wow. So much more to clean. I guess we're getting closer to town. Where are we on the map? Oh, there's like a giant retaining wall here. And it looks like some sort of uh, like toxic area too. I guess technically we're still on Grandpa's old farm. Oh, wait a minute. Global map. Oh, there's a much bigger map than this. Look at how big the map is. That's crazy. So this is just the farm area here. Right in this area. So there's like a winter biome. What looks to be maybe like a, a mountain biome. A desert biome. And then like a... I don't know. Maybe like a somewhat of a sandy area. And then an island too. That's cool. So each one of these doors must be like fast travel points we can eventually go to. Something like that. Oh boy, lots of enemies. Is that another chicken? No, that's the box we need. Hey, I need that. Hey, there's another piece of glass. All right, so we're definitely in the right spot. So Cornelius needs that glass for the disco ball. That's two out of five, I think it was. So that's probably the last area we gotta go to. But first, 
I want to see if we can get across here. Can't jump, so we have to use materials like that. Ah, Japanese decoration pot and fries with ketchup. Hell yeah. Awesome. So potato plus tomato equals ketchup and fries. Awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> really awesome. I love ketchup and fries. Good, man. Good times. All right, what does the other main door go to? If that one goes to that little junk area, do they both go to the same place? This one looks like it would go down here, maybe, because we have to cross a bridge first. I want those guys to power up. All right, let's go through. Those are some big doors. The other door looked like it was meant for somebody else, like an elf or something. This is a big-o door. Oh, music's changing. Fast travel unlocked to the village. All right, this must be the way to Mark's then. Let's go see if we can meet with them. We'll probably find another piece for the uh, disco ball here. This area is really nice for finding stuff, I'm sure. Oh, look at that. Yep. Oh, look at that tree. It's all toxic and stuff, too. Yep, you can see nuclear waste and stuff over there. And a doggo! Can you pet the doggo? Hi, doggy. Aw, hello, doggy. Cool. Hey, and another chicken. Who needs another coop? So we can make a bigger chicken coop and get even more chicken. So down there is probably the rest of the glass pieces. And over here, too. And we'll need to upgrade the drill to get through that. Are you Mark? Impossible! It, 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 it's you, isn't it? Max's little girl, Elda, Elliot, <laughs> Erland, was it? Um, it's me, Ellen. Ah, good meaning. My memory's not as bad as I, I thought. You've grown. I remember when you were a little pup prancing around. Okay. What happened to my grandpa? Well, not that fast. Elsa. Wow, that's not even our name, sir. I'll tell you what. Before I set off to follow your grandpa's trail, we're in need of your help. Since we're already grown and a strong and capable adult and living on a farm, it would be no mystery to you. You could help us here in the time of need. Oh, with the vac pal equipment. Yes. Please tell me more about that. Yes, I want the upgrade. Uh, let's see. I'm assuming you want me to grow a certain number of stuff or whatnot, right? Let's see. Tell, tell, me, the, tell, me, the, tell me the quest. Prove to me that you can take good care of the chickens. I, it's all about the chickens. This game's all about chickens. Find Mark the shopkeep. We did. All right. Prove to me that the chickens around here have no hard feelings towards you. Ah, there we go. Bring proof of chicken friendship to Mark the shopkeeper. Proof of chicken friendship. Well, I guess that means we got to go home and get the chickens, the uh, disco ball going, and then maybe get more chickens in the area. Wait, can we go through this door? I want to see more of the world. Oh, this one's locked. Where would it go? Oh, it would go out to the destroyed highway. Yep, and that would lead to the coast. Oh, so there's a highway that kind of comes from up here. Goes through this deserty area and then goes maybe to the island? Alright, I guess we can go through there in the future. But, what do you got for sale, Mark? Oh yeah, same stuff as at home. So we don't have to go all the way back here to buy stuff. It looks like he has a little mobile shop. But it's still good that we were able to chat with them. Very nice. All right, let's head home. All right, more eggs from the chickens. Looks like they want a bath. I wonder if that's the thing we can make for them. Let's see. Is there a chicken bath, maybe? Oh, animals. Maybe there's something like that. Or an upgrade for it. Ah... Uh, Sprinkler to water nearby fields. That's going to be helpful. Good stuff. Beehives, too? Mayo makers? Making jam? I love the art style and all this stuff. Very looks, uh, very much looks like... Um, I don't know. There's a lot of quality there. It looks really nice. I like how it's all painted. And I like the building design, too. Very, very nice. Very nice. Well, you've seen it before on the channel, and No Place Like Home is finally out in full release. With fishing and new features added since the early access sometime in 2020, this game's made a lot of great improvements and a lot of new additional features 
to a lot of things that were already there. I'm delighted to see all the things with the llamas, the questing at the start with the chickens, and of course, the whole world that expands much further than I'd ever seen before. Very nice. I'm glad that the developers reached out and asked me to give it a try again. And if you'd like me to play this one more, don't forget to hit that like button if you'd like to see a full playthrough or possibly some more big O live streams. Thanks again to the developers and the makers of No Place Like Home for sponsoring today's video. And again, remember to check it out with the links down below in the description and get it today. I'll see you guys soon. Thank you very much for watching. Of course, another wonderful base building, crafting, survival simulator with all sorts of fun to build your very own farm. I love it. And I'll see you soon. Thanks again for watching. Goodbye.